What is up, everybody? Super Spino is back. Good morning to all of you Pokemon fans out there. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. How are we today? Hopefully, we're all amazing. Um, but yeah, guys. Yeah, today is another exciting adventure of Pokemon Go. Ooh, Cliff, I might have already done him. So, for those of you guys who don't already know, uh, the Luminous Legends ends in about eight days. I need Sierra and Arlo, so I gotta hold off on that balloon for now. But how have your guys' dark Pokemon been going? They're the hunt for the dark Pokemon. I'll tell you, I actually um, was pretty excited, and I'll tell you why. <clears throat> because in order to evolve your guys Pancham, you had to catch, uh, oh my gosh, 32. You had to catch 32 of these dark guys, 32, and then boom, I got myself a Pongoro. Look at him, so cool. Mm, I thought it was cool anyway. But yeah, so I'm gonna at least become a little bit of buddies with this guy because he's cool. But yeah, have you guys got your Pangoru yet? Let's see. Man, my mine does not like to be played with. Maybe on his belly a little bit. There we go. Oh, my bad. We gotta feed him a candies. We gotta feed him a quick candies. Alright, so we'll go ahead and do that. But yeah, guys, so the Battle League, all seasons five, okay. Sorry, season seven is gonna end in a day and 24 hours, so I hope you guys are um, caught up as much as you can be, because it is, it is over this coming Monday. So tomorrow, actually, at uh, 2 p.m., it's going down. So I'm super excited about that, guys. That's gonna be that's gonna be awesome to have a brand new, fresh start to the to the league. Um, I myself want to get more invested. Plus, when they come to the end of the league like this, those of you who've been participating a lot are gonna be getting a ton of Stardust. So again, if you guys haven't been uh, participating, do as much as you can within the next within the next, uh, you know, looks like f probably 26 hours, give or take. All right. Um, yep, so there's that. The Luminous Legends, guys. I have yet to get myself a shiny Zigzagoon, unfortunately. Anybody out there have a shiny Zigzagoon? If you do, super jelly here. Super, super jelly. But yeah, other than that, guys, um, how many Eveltals do you have? Like, um, pretty decent Eveltals. I'll, I'll show you mine right now. The Eveltals that I have um, are pretty decent. Like, I got myself a, at least a hundred percent Eveltal, so that was really, really cool. I liked that. Um, and then this is my—I don't even think that's my next best. This is my next best. Um, and then this guy would be my next next best, a third best. So I've gotten I've gotten some decent Eveltals, not too bad. And I was like, I was wondering, I'm like, well, with Eveltal out now, who's better, Darkrai or Eveltal? Uh, it turns out that they are very close. Um, they're very close, guys. Collections full. They're very very close. Um, uh, Darkrai tends to have a little bit more attack power, but can't take much, like, of a hit. So its defense and its HP, like its stamina, aren't as good as Eveltal, and its attack is a slightly better um, stat. So, for those of you who are wondering, yeah, they're they're very close. Darkrai is better with attack, Eveltal is better with its defense and its um, stamina, or HP, for for those of you out there. All right, now what can we do? Oh, whoops. 
What can we do about getting rid of some of these guys? Let's see. Huh. All those Eveltals are good enough to keep. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of the vision here. Um, but yeah, guys, make sure that you guys are taking advantage of... It looks like Arlo's team, uh, Cliff's team. Oh yeah, they, they changed up, guys. Nope, that's not what I'm trying to do. Um, so Arlo's got himself the Vananet, which can be shiny. Shiny Shadow Vananet would be sweet. Like, super sweet. Um, and then you have Cliff's team. Shiny C Dot, and then the rest of these guys. Shiny Sneasel for Sierra, which would be dope. See? There you go. Shiny Shadow Pokemon are right there. And then uh, the Dark type Pokemon in the wild. Hopefully, you guys have caught mm, uh, any one of these shinies. Uh, me personally, I got the Alolan Rattata. I have not gotten any other shinies. I really wanted that Hound Hour, but uh, unfortunately, that hasn't happened for me just yet. Um, eggs have been great. 12k eggs have been great. Uh, one star. I haven't really done any of the one star rates. I should be doing the Sneasels because I need about 15 more ice types. And he would be, he would, uh, definitely help me out with my ice types. Let's clear out our inventory here, guys. So keep that one. That one's probably not good enough. Oh, I got a sand. Oh, my gosh. You guys can't even see what I'm seeing. Um, let me show you guys. Sorry about that. It's weird. I'm telling you guys, this little program is, is great when it works, but it's a curse when it doesn't. Now it's saying it doesn't want to work. What in the world? It could have been my uh, other program there that booted it out. I don't know. But that's all right, guys. So, yeah, I'm super excited for the uh, upcoming community day. Who else is out there? wanting to go with the community day. The community day is going to be sweet. I'm super excited for that, guys. Not going to lie. Super excited for that community day. The Gibble community day. It's going to be awesome, guys. Let's see. I just got to switch that over real quick. Sorry about that, guys. Perfect. Yeah, so I got a sand dial, guys. I was so excited about that sand dial. Like, I was super excited about that sand dial. It was fantastic. Um, hold on. I was so excited about that, guys. It was fantastic. Um, but anyway, yeah. So, I got myself a sand dial. Uh, oh, shiny Sneasel. I actually did hatch this one out of an egg, guys. So, I did get a little bit. A little bit of luck there. Of course, we're not going to get rid of that Scorpy, but... Alright, let's go through the rest of these guys, shall we? Did a ton of the Veltal raids. I really don't want to get rid of my panchums. Oh. There we go. Okay. These guys are not worth keeping around, so I'm going to dump them all.
Gotta get to the meat so I can get rid of a bunch of this stuff. Yeah, and keep the pensions. Hear that zoo? Oh, I keep the zoo bat. I think that's the only shadow zoo bat that I have left. I got rid of a bunch of shadows. Well, there you go. It's as good as it's gonna get for now, I guess. All right. Anyway, we'll do a couple battles while we're talking about this other stuff. I like to stick with a 1500. It seems like we have better luck in there, anyway. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, Megas. I don't know if you guys have had the the chance to do enough Mega Altaria raids so that you guys could actually um, get that Mega Altaria, and then you have Mega Hound Doom. I love Mega Hound Doom. Um, and guys, you have to at least, and I didn't know this originally, but you have to at least get the 200 candies for the Mega to Mega Evolve your Pokemon. Um, before you can even uh, go and uh, I don't even know um, mega like walk with them as your buddy to get those mega candies so just so you guys know I didn't know originally but that is something you have to evolve like my Charizard for example I thought oh yeah this is cool but it's because I had already mega evolved him one time so then I can mega evolve him or walk with him as my buddy and mega evolve him continuously just by getting those candy same thing with my Gengar um, yes guys it is coming up to a close here pretty darn quick if you guys have those shadow Pokemon that are Dece you want to make sure to get rid of that frustration move with the charge TM and learn something else because that's coming up to a close here guys this is getting it's getting close Ah, what in the world just happened there? Eh, that's all right. And I have no protecting shields. I don't know what happened there. Anyway, um, so yeah, guys, the event is going to end here soon. So get your Panchums, get your, your shiny Galarian, um, Zigzagoon, guys. Field research tasks, you guys can get a shiny Scorpy, shiny Meowth, a couple other cool things. You've got to be kidding, my, my Altaria is dead? Man, that's what you get for, don't pay, for not paying attention. <laughs> anyway, guys. Um, yeah, so there's that. Let's see. Luminous Legends Y. Mm, there you go. The limited research will give you encounters with these guys. So yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm sure we're all pretty familiar with the event that's going on right now. Just as a quick reminder, guys, part one is going to be coming up to an end on Mon May, May 24th. Now, one other thing I wanted to talk to you guys about is Silvana. Sylveon, excuse me. Now, Sylveon is going to be... Well, actually, it's already released, guys. So, all you've got to do to get your Sylveon is... Uh, um, sorry. All you guys have to do to get your Sylveon is um, give it 70 hearts. So if you guys wa uh, get get an EV and give it sev like 70 hearts as far as like your friendship level goes. So after a couple of days you, and you end up giving your EV 70 hearts, kind of like in the games, right? You, you want to be really good friends with EV and then you're good, right? Man, Golurk is a beast. Then boom, you have yourself a Sylveon. So that's cool. Um, Giovanni's Shadow Moltres. I guess uh, you're able to do another Shadow Moltres, guys. And that's what what I'm going to be getting here pretty quick is that Shadow Moltres. And then in eight days, uh, so at the end of this coming week, guys, um, it's going to go away. And then you're going to end up being able to achieve a 
Zapdos. Shadow Zapdos. So that's going to be pretty exciting. Come on. This guy's got a Grand Bowl. you got to be kidding me. Well, we'll see what happens. Hopefully he uses uh, something. Yep. Perf. All right. We're using Shadow Ball. We can do this. Yeah, I'm going to take it. All right. And then Season of Legends. Guys, we went over that last week, so I'm not going to touch up on it a whole lot this week. And then the Megas. We already uh, talked about the Megas. Um... They're already out right now. You got your Altaria, your Houndoom, and your Amphros. Okay, so that's nothing special. Yay, we won! Alright, and then Meryl Spotlight Hour. That's coming up on Tuesday. So if you guys don't have your shiny Meryls, get ready because it's happening. Um, Eveltal, Eveltal Raid Hour, they're going to have that one again, um, coming up here in a couple of days, Wednesday to be exact, for an hour, be ready for that, that's going to be cool, uh, special event weekend, guys, now, I've been talking to some buddies about it, for all trainers, we're going to be able to double the gifts, and trade range is going to be increased to 40 kilometers, that's going to be fantastic, however, if you are a Verizon customer in the United States, these Pokemon are going to be appearing to you guys in incense. Okay, and then also you're going to be able to get an unknown from that incense. All right. Um, Shiny Eevee might be boosted for the event. The Shiny Evolution is going to be shown here below. So, boom. Boom. Throw down an incense, catch a ton of EVs, get a bunch of shiny EVs, evolve them into the evolution, get all your evolutions that you don't have already. Make it happen. All right. <clears throat> so anyway, what you got to do is you got to get into the My Verizon app if you have it, and then generate a code and redeem that code. That's essentially what you need to do. I've been asking questions to my buddies like, hey, uh, how many codes can you generate? How many accounts is one code good for? Um, I've heard that one code is good for one account. You can only generate um, one code as well. So I'm not 100% sure on exactly how that all works, guys. But I am going to figure it out by the time the event hits by the end of the weekend. Let's see what we can do. <clears throat> all right. So the Shadow Zapdos is going to start start in about eight days gibble community day now this is one thing i did want to go over a little bit more in detail because they have more details guys so for the raid hour which is not this weekend it's going to be uh i think two weekends out so not next weekend but the following and uh, you're gonna have the triple catch xp of course you have increased spawns from gibble you have a three-hour incense, as per usual, on the community days. And the exclusive community day move for Garchomp is going to be Earth Power. So, super exciting, guys. Gonna love that. I'm definitely gonna go with the exclusive special research story, so you guys can get it on that. We will be doing a live event um, to show you guys our success, to hang out with you guys, to talk. Um, but we'll be out and about doing that community day, guys. So super excited about that. I'm definitely going to block that move. And then here's your shiny gibbles. Shiny gibble, shiny goodbye. <clears throat> and then, uh, oh no. And shiny Garchomp. And then here's that little... Uh, Oh, he uses Surf. That's what I get for not paying attention. Anyway, 
Um, <clears throat> yeah, guys. So Earth Power. That's going to be a really cool move for Garchomp. I'm super excited for that, guys. He's going to have that. Plus, if I get the double moves, I can have Earth Power as one, which I'm sure is going to be super great. And then the secondary move, I'm going to throw up a dragon type move for sure. Should have waited till I had my dragon pulse, but that's fine. Haha, <laughs> we won. All right. Definitely going to get the bundle with the elite pass. Um, just a nibble. That's so funny. Garchomp loves chomping on things. But yeah, guys, so I'm super excited about uh, the community day. We will be going live for the event, and we will cover a big brunt of the event. So that's going to be super exciting. And then the next one is going to be GoFest this year, guys. I am super excited. I am going to, uh, yeah, definitely reserve some time. I'm going to get the 17th and the 18th off for us, guys. We will be doing and covering the Pokemon Go Fest for sure. Two days of Pokemon. We are, yeah, it is going to be fantastic. Super excited about that. Looks like I got to reboot this. Yeah, there we go. Good thing we clear, cleared out our inventory. Poliwhirl, let's go. Yeah. All right, guys. So yeah, that's going to be awesome. Mark your calendars. I will be going live. I'm going to be doing some live footage, guys. It's going to be great. We can celebrate. Oh, look at that. Almost ranked 10 for this season. What? All right, let's keep going. But yeah, guys, so that is going to be awesome. Really excited for that. Yeah, Leak Duck. That's where you can find all your. Ooh. Yeah, not trying to. What in the world? I don't know if y'all saw that, but that was glitchy. Super glitch. <clears throat> all right. This Raichu is not going to know what hit him. Oh, yeah. Bring out your Blissey, bro. I will gladly take him out. <laughs> As y'all know, uh, you know, weak to fighting for sure. Blissey's got loads of health. Loads of health, but is super weak to fighting moves. So me being able to just hound, hash it out, dude, and then load him down with all these body slams one shield one shield i'm not gonna go crazy i'm just gonna do one aha there we go oh 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 come on come on pay attention here spiny let's do this ow used a shield to block bros not even going to worry about using another ultimate to my next go around. <clears throat> oh, I see why they switched out for a, for a Blissey. Because they had a Weavile that's hiding in the back wanting not to get destroyed too. <laughs> that's crazy, guys. Oh, I should have used it. Oh, well. Game over for you, buddy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. Yes. <clears throat> oh, guys. I got 43. I didn't even tell you guys. I got 43. So excited. I was so excited when I hit 43. You know, the funny thing is, like, I was too busy posting, um, I guess other things on my channel that I didn't even <laughs> I didn't even really put out my 43 success but that's okay well maybe today I'll drop it oh shiny oh my gosh I really wanted these this one guys a shiny Cresselia guys like this is something that I wanted real bad like super bad but I couldn't get him like I did a lot of Cresselia raids and the other thing was at the time, I didn't have like extremely good Pokemon. 
um, when they came out with Shiny Cresselia. So I was honestly like with my account, my secondary account, and uh, two other accounts, I wasn't even able to take down. I don't know why I blocked a grass knot. Whatever. Anyway, um, <clears throat> I wasn't able to get myself a Shiny Cresselia, but that's okay. We will. When they come out with Shiny Cresselia again, you bet I'm going to be... I'm definitely going to be out there getting myself a Shiny Cresselia. For sure, guys. For sure. Alright. Two, one, and... Uh, grass Knot. Oh my gosh, it killed me. Oh well. At least I'm on the same playing field as far as uh, shields go. Perfect. Good job, Altaria. All right, and let's see what we can do. Oh, wow, Marowak. I wonder if Dragon Pulse will even do anything. Sky Attack may have been a better option, but we'll see. Nope. I don't think he's going to be able to do a whole lot to me, so I'm just going to bone club. Yeah. Good thing I didn't, guys. That that did nothing to me, dude. That did absolutely nothing to my Altaria. It took him down by like a sliver. That was like a regular attack. This guy is fooling. This guy is fooling for sure. All right. Last one. Who's it going to be? Oh my gosh, he is a dead man. Superior, I love Superior. It's go it, it kills me. I'm going to have to take him down, guys. Oh, super factor. All right. I mean, why not? I have one shield left, and this very well might be Okay, there we go. Frenzy plant done all right <clears throat> just going through the motions here guys battling in the league we are rocking and rolling oh no nope i mean i could go master league but there's so many good people out there in master league it is ridiculous like they have pokemon that are maxed out and they have double up on the abilities and they're just <laughs> god mode essentially it's crazy. Obstagoon and Vigoroth are very close. Inability. Alright, let's see. Oh, shoot. He's got to have... S yeah, better not risk it. Cross chop. Good thing I didn't, dude. That would have that would have annihilated me. Oh, that Wiggly dude. I'm thinking, I yeah, I'm gonna use this. He'll either block it or he won't, and if he doesn't, great. I'm gonna switch over to my Marowak, because that's gonna be not very effective against me. And then honestly. I don't think he's going to be able to beat my Marowak, so I'm just going to kind of hang tough. Yeah, not very effective. Figured. Alright. <clears throat> and then his fighting moves aren't going to do anything against my Marowak. I'm using this just as a... Oh my goodness. Well, I guess I can't do anything against him either. Yeah, screw it. Good thing I did, too. That would have killed me. Alright, where are we at? JJ! Shadow Ball! Oh my gosh, I was going to freaking freak out. I was going to freak out, guys. 
He's out, and then all he's got left is his Obstagoon, which is going to get destroyed by my health. Oh my gosh, I have both my guys still. Oh, he killed one of my guys. Oh, that was nuts. That was great. Oh my gosh, easy peasy. All right, guys, we are doing another one. Another one. Another one. <laughs> oh, you fan lovers out there. Oh, yes. Flower Raichu. He's cute. I like him. We're going to destroy this man. Oh, hey, it's all good, bro. If you don't want to block any of my moves, that's cool. I'm going to definitely block his, though, for sure. Because it could be Brick Break. Yeah, I called it. And with it being Brick Break, that would have definitely given me some problems, for sure. Now, this isn't a fighting move, so me coming out and hitting him with this would be a normal type move, which who knows what that'll do. But hey, as long as he's blowing through his shields, like, that's what it's all about. Mmm, I don't know. Yeah, I'm just going to take it. Shadow Bone. Not very effective. Didn't think it would be. Good thing I just decided to take it. Oh, my normal types are not doing anything to this guy. Well, I'm going to switch it up to my Altaria and hit him with some sky attacks. Yeah, Shadow Bone probably won't do anything to this guy either. Hopefully not, anyway. Oh, it did a little bit more than I was anticipating. Not a big deal. Oh, and my defense fell. Guys, I need to get Shadow Bone on my, uh, on my Marowak for sure. Because, as you guys can see, that's just tough. Yeah, I'm definitely going to block this one just because I, I, I'd rather not die than to die. Alright, X Scissor's done. And, oh, he's got X Scissor. Hopefully the Sky Attack does something. I know that he's a bug and a Steel type. Sky would definitely kill the bug. I mean... Dang. I'm going to pull back out my little uh, Vigoroth here. Do a body slam. Not very effective, but it was effective enough. I took him down. Woo -hoo -hoo! Winning. I'm telling you guys, this team is a solid team. Honestly. A uh, person's got a Verizon sweatshirt. We all know what she's going to be doing in next weekend. Oh, switched it straight out for Pelipper. <laughs> What's up, Pelipper? Are you going to take my shots? Good. You know what? I got two shields. I'm going to block this one. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I'm blocking this one, too. That's fine. Good. Use Weather Ball. Good job. You're dead. And I've got one and a half of my body slams left. Ooh, not very... Fighting's not very good against Garvantula. Mm, that's interesting. Hmm... 
I'm just going to keep on throwing these body slams at this guy, guys. He's so mad right now. He's so mad. <laughs> oh my gosh, why? Why is this happening? How can he get off so many body slams? I got body slams for days, bro. Oh, he got me. Man, I've been seeing a lot of these Stunfisks out here. I can't do anything about it. So if he's got his little uh, thingy majig. Wah! What's up, Ivy Griggs? Welcome to the madness. Welcome to the fun. Thank you for dropping that follow, Ivy. And I hope to see you on many more streams to come. Oh my... Yeah, of course everything's going to be super effective against my Altaria. No. Now I'm getting mad, guys. How can he do this to me? He can't. He won't. Not very effective. Great. I don't even have any shields. Well, this one just might be the end of me. Two. One. Rock slide. Yeah. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, he's got uh, probably shock or something. I don't know. Yep, discharge. GG. GG, lady. You got the best of me. You got the best of me. I didn't want to let my Vigoroth go, and so I uh, just went through it. But, yeah. All right. 470 Stardust, a fast TM, a Flaffy. Flaffy. Okay. Boom. Got him in the Pokeball, guys. Got him in the Pokeball. All right. Got to catch 430 Pokemon. Let's go. I'm going to go to uh, uh, that Lagoon I was talking about. I'm going to be going there again today, guys. Getting some crazy mods. Oh, this one is going to be crazy. No, no. I want to go back. Yes. Look at that, guys. Holy moly. If I could win all five battles. No, 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 no. What just happened? No. No, you guys lost me. Give me just a second. Just one quick second, guys. I will get it back up and going. Hold on. I'm sorry. Like I say, this uh, program is amazing when it works. And it's a curse when it doesn't. Guys, did you did you at least get to see my rewards? I hope so. That would be pretty awesome. Okay, here it is, guys. 750 if I can win 5 times, that'd be thousands of stardust. Let's see what we could do. Let's see what we could do. Oh, and we're almost level 10, guys. We're almost in the 10th ranking. I'm super excited. You just got an ad? What do you mean? Hopefully. If you're subbed, all of my subs do not get ads. Sorry, bro. <laughs> I don't really know what's up there. It's crazy. Four, three. Ah, I'm taking it, dude. I'm just taking it. Come on. Come on. What in the world is going on? Did that guy disconnect? Looks like it. I mean, I'm just pounding out his Pokemon. <laughs> okay. I hope y'all are seeing this. This is crazy. I think the guy disconnected or has a weak connection or something. You've got to be kidding me. And I'm not going to use any heavies, guys, because I don't want the screen to load forever. So I'm just going to keep pounding away until, until he's gone. If he comes back, great. If he doesn't, that's all right. 
what yeah dude this is weird right this is super weird he's like it's not even happening oh and the reason it's taking forever is because he's not choosing his guys they're just summoning and so the faster i can get rid of this guy the better shiny charizard oh my gosh i love shinies i love shiny and i love charizard it's going down <laughs> yeah bro that's awesome the long neck bird <laughs> he's a dragon doll he's a dragon <laughs> that's awesome Yes, you win. We win. The hero to be Superman. Let's see. Okay, one out of five, guys. Here it goes. Let's go. Let's go. Consul Maximus. Let's do this. Oh, Azumi. Okay, Azumarill is the one of the only Pokemon that I know that I absolutely hate. Well, in, in battles anyway. I think Zumarill itself is a really good Pokemon, but I'm even considering switching out my Marowak for an Azumarill just because Azumarill I mean Azumarill's amazing. She's got fairy moves. She's got water moves. She's got ice moves. It's it's just it's crazy how good Azumarill is. So I'm thinking. I mean, I have a decent Azumi, and maybe that's what we do, guys. Maybe after this round, we jump into my Azumarill. Get Azumarill a secondary move. I wanted to get a shiny one, and I think I got one that's good enough to battle with. Oh my gosh. Of course. <laughs> it summoned something random for me, apparently. Yes. Okay. Doing it. I'm going dragon against dragon. I know it's probably the stupidest thing I could have done, but you know what? I'm all about it. Could be dragon claw or something, so I'm not going to risk it. I'm going to throw up a shield. My best Pokemon is my 100% Mewtwo. That's my best one. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Oh, he doesn't have a Dragon-type move. Yeah, I do, bro. Oh my gosh, he's got a freaking Gyarados. Yes, yes, yes! I got off my Sky Attack just in time. He's gonna be like, oh, Dragon Pulse? It's not gonna be a big deal. Oh my gosh. Great, great, great. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm dead, dude. There's no there's no freaking way I can survive this Gyarados. There's no way. Crunch. Okay, okay. At least his... Oh, no, 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 no. Because I am super weak against Dark-type moves as well. So that's a double for me. Okay, the Shadow Ball either kills this Gyarados, guys. It either kills it or I'm just dead, dude. I'm just dead got my bro calling me oh my gosh what did she have play rough oh i don't think that's very effective please 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 oh yes not very effective but the bubble is the bubble beam is stop calling me bro gotta go into do not disturb <laughs> dang we freaking lost that one that's it, guys. We're doing it. We're doing it. We are... Actually, I want to catch this Fennekin. I haven't seen a Fennekin for a while. So I'm going to throw a little berry at it. All right, perfect. Okay, now I'm going to go into my Azumarill's. Oh, and uh, hold on one quick second, guys. Um, I'm going to hit the BRB button. 
we got a spider situation. So, Spiny, BRB. Well, I am pleased to announce, guys. It has been exterminated. Ho, ho, ho. All right. Back to business. Okay, so you guys want to see. Now, I wanted to get an Azumarill that was going to be good enough to battle. And honestly, I, I have some decent Azumis. This one is probably going to be one of the better ones. So I'm going to go ahead and drop him with a new charge attack. He's got Play Rough, and now he's got Ice Beam, and then Rock Smash. Ooh, but no Water-type move. Ooh, that's going to be an issue. But no, 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 I don't need Rock Smash, because I've already got a Fighting-type move on my other one, so I'll use Bubble. Okay, now we're going to get this guy up to as far as we can pump him. Oh, wow, 1499. All right, yes, I dumped a lot of uh, Stardust into that guy, but hey, I mean, it's definitely going to be worth it in the long run. And um, we're going to get tons of Stardust right here, too. Not as much, granted, but... And Marowak is really good, but I'm going to go with Azumi. Yeah, there we go. Got to keep rolling with the punches, guys, and hopefully that Azumarill... Oop, what am I doing going to the Master League? I'm crazy, that's what. I'm just crazy. P2 Master? Sounds intriguing. All right, he's got this Gyarados, which has got a water move. Thinking about it, thinking about it. I wonder if my Azumarill's Ice Beam would be super effective since he's a flying type as well, but a water type. I don't know. We'll find out. I don't know what this is going to be. I'm taking it head on, though. Not very effective. Figured. Jolteon? Oh, oh, I should have used my Ice Beam, but I used Play Rough. Oh, my goodness. Oh, well. I mean, he'll block it anyway, so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you best believe I'm blocking his ultimate move. 
And now that I know what the Gyarados is capable of, just the water and the uh, the crunch, my Altaria can definitely take that guy out. Freezing up that electricity. And he's out. Perfect. Telling you guys, Azumarill is a freaking beast. If you can, make it happen. All right, let's see what this Ice Beam can do to a Gyarados. I mean, he's already gotten... Oh! Nice. Honestly, I'm just going to take it, guys. I could care less. Destroyer, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Barton Boy subscribed for two months. Thanks, Barton Boy. It means a lot, bro. I appreciate you very much. Uh, bro, we could definitely be friends. I'm totally down. Um, I got to put my trainer code out there, and then you guys... I mean, I, I, I could be friends with all you guys. I'm good with it. I only got, I think, 70-something something friends, so I have plenty of room for you guys. Plentiful. Room of plentiful. Boom. Come on. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I'm switching out for Vigoroth. Night Slash. You know what? I have an extra shield, so I'm going to use it, but honestly, I probably wouldn't need to. All right. I'll post it up here in just a second. Done. Easy. Done like dinner. On a Thanksgiving day, guys. Woo! -hoo! We got it. We got it. All right. Okay. So, really quick, just to get this out the way, and so I don't forget, mainly 79 friends. So, I got plenty of room, as you guys can see. Here you go. There's my trainer code. So, if you guys want to pause the vid, you can. If you want to add me, you absolutely can. So just go ahead and uh, put that into your Pokemon Go. Send me a request. You bet I will accept it. Got you guys. I got you guys. All right. Back to battling. Oh, no. Not there. Perfect. Right there. We're good. Oh, my gosh. It's happening. Raichu is kind of like the electric version of Azumarill. Just saying. He's pretty sweet. Plus, he's got that fighting move as well, which is nice. Okay. Yes, my fighting moves are not going to be very effective against this Marowak. But the thing is, if I switch out to Azumarill, he'll probably switch out to something else. And honestly, we're not doing bad. Oh, even that's not effective. Okay, good. He made the first switch. Perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use play rough on this guy. Mm, I don't think his dynamic punch would or cross chop even would be. Yeah, I didn't think it would be very effective. I'm going to throw out a play rough on this guy. Keep going. Hit me with those cross chops. Left, right, left, right. I don't care. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep on soaking up the damage. But it's tough luck for you, buddy. I got my fairy move up now. <laughs> he he just soaked it up. He's like, yeah, I could take this punch too. Uh, honestly, guy, per yeah, really you can't sue. Play Rough is also super effective against dragon moves. I mean, I guess I could have gone Ice Beam and Ice Beam charges a little bit faster, but whatever. Okay. Now, this is where I want to start blocking because if he has Sky Attack, that's super effective against my Azumarill. So, definitely not going to be... Oh, no, you're good, man. As soon as I'm done with, uh, as soon as I'm done with this one, then I will switch it up. Bone Club. Oof, I didn't want to take any damage there. Oh, no, he's got another Bone Club. And pro honestly, he's probably not even very effective. Let's find out. Bone Club. Oh, barely. Why? Oh, no, 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 no. Not Ice Beam. Not Ice Beam. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. 
It's not gonna be very effective. Oh, but it is effective at getting, getting rid of him using his shield. So good, cool, cool, cool. Hit that Altari. I don't care. He's got full HP. <laughs> Barton. Boom, 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 boom. All right, friends. We are going to kill this Marowak or faint him. All right, and now with him having an Altaria as a secondary guy, and he has no shields left. Oh, what is that? Spido with the Dragon Balls. Down goes the opposing Altaria. Wow, he soaked it, guys. He, he didn't even die. I hit him with a couple Dragon Breaths. We win. We are victorious. Victorious. I love it. All right, so I'm going to collect another Stardust, and then I will pop that back open for you, buddies. Boom. There it is. Oh, Destroyer. You're, I'm, And that's, that's the thing. Okay, I'll tell you right now. So, your Pokemon might not be the best right now, but that's what it's all about, bro. You catch them, you make them your buddy, and, um, and then you just you raise them. To be the best that they, you know, the best that they very can be. You know. Like no one ever was. Barton with the biddies! What? Oh my gosh. Let's go, Barton. Let's go. Let's go, Barton. Let's go. Alright. Man, I feel a hype train, in, train coming on. <laughs> Alright, Destroyer. Hopefully you got that all, buddy. I think the Phoenix is uh, uh, definitely... Uh, hey, I got it all, Spino. Perfect. That is fantastic. Now, back to business, guys. We are going to annihilate this guy. Whoever it may be. Guys, we are, we are fighting people all the way up in, in the 12 ranking. Elected? You can't be Whoa, whoa, whoa. That Alekid is actually packing a punch, guys. I did not expect him to come out right out the gate with a fighting move. <laughs> then he's got Brick Break. What a cutie. That's awesome. <laughs> All right, we're going to body slam him. Hopefully he uses up a shield, maybe two shields, who knows. Oh yeah, he used his shield. Alright, let's go with another one. Hopefully he, he uses another shield. It doesn't even matter. If he uses a shield, great. Because that's less shields he can use during the rest of it. And honestly, like that's what my main purpose originally for using Vigoroth is to flush those shields out. That's why I use him first is because his charge attack move loads up super quick. Smolover, Smolover, what's up? And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with my uh, Azumarill. There it is, shiny Azumarill. All right, and then I'm gonna hit him with an Ice Beam. Yeah, we can do this. He got no more. You've got nowhere to run. You've got nowhere to hide. It's over for you. And I'm not going to use ice because ice is going to be not very effective on this guy. Honestly, I might as well. He probably used surf. Maybe ice beam. I don't really know. Yeah, it is a shiny. Shiny Azumi. And honestly, uh, I'm thinking about just getting out a bunch of shinies. Like, I want to use my... Well, actually, I don't really think I can use my shiny Altaria. Just because he's so good. He's like a 98% and I'd want him to be my Mega Altaria. Shiny Megi Altaria. But... Yeah, he just uses Surf. Not very effective. You ready to play rough, Lapras? Come at me, bro. Come at me. Ooh, he's almost gone. Oh, you know, like 508 shinies. <laughs> Maybe more. 511. I don't know. Somewhere in the 500 range. 
He's like, yeah, yeah, I got his Azumarill. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, there's one more Pokemon. But it's too late. You're done. You're gone. Oh, Smolover, thank you for the follow. And welcome to the community. We love Pokemon. We love playing Pokemon. Pokemon Sundays. Oh, guys, I mentioned this earlier, but I'm going to mention it again. Do not forget Shiny Community, or Shiny Community, Gibble Community Day. That is going to be happening on the 6th. I am super excited for that. And we'll be covering, we'll be covering it live. Whoa, guys, we jumped from 10 to 11 in one sitting. It's like, well, if this guy's just whomping on level 12s, uh, then, uh, <laughs> then we should probably put him in a higher ranking. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, guys. Let's see, did we unlock anything? Ooh, Frillish. I want a blue Frillish or an Emolga. That'd be super sweet. Guys, we are doing amazing. We are killing it today, guys. Oh, small over. Hold on, let me back. Oh, battle is starting. Stay tuned. I will put my uh, battle code up there. Unless, uh, Destroyer, if you want to put up the my battle code into the chat, that would help me out a lot. Or, uh, Barton, I know we're friends. If you want to throw my uh, trainer code in the chat, that'd be cool. What? What just happened? Okay, never mind. I'll, I'll throw it up there for you guys. Destroyer. We are now friends. Okay, there you go. There's my trainer code. Smoll over. Let me know when you're ready. <laughs> you have to have it memorized, bro. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Not a big deal. I just threw it up there. All right, small over. We're just waiting on you. But anyway, guys, I love, love, love doing these battles. And the, and the team that we're using is unstoppable. Okay, it's stoppable. But it's still, it's so good. It is so good. I love it. I love it. We've got a, um, we got, so with Vigoroth, which I could absolutely, okay, I'm waiting. Um, but we got Vigoroth that has a fighting primary type move. And then he's got his Body Slam, which is a normal type move. Then we have Altaria. Altaria's got a Dragon type primary move. Uh, uh, flying attack secondary move with another uh, charged up Dragon type move. Super killer. Then we've got the Azumarill in there with a Water Attack, Ice Charge, and Fairy Charge. we got a, a vast majority of type moves that we can use, guys. I mean, it's it's fantastic. The mark. Um, so if you're looking at Barton boys in the in the chat, the diamond means he's VIP because Barton boy comes to every single one of my streams, so he's VIP. First means he's he was one of the very first people to subscribe to me on my channel. Um, and then the number, the two there, uh, is he's a tier two subscriber. Oh, oh, yeah, that's the Poke Genie. Yep. So what I like Pokey Genie, um, because you can go in here and you can find out like, and I, and I'm not selling this or anything. I'm just showing you what I do. Um, and I'm not affiliated with them by any means. So just putting that out there, but yeah, guys, so you appraise your Pokemon, you, whoops, and then you click on the little Poke Genie symbol. Boom, it tells me how much he's got going on for him. And then I honestly, I think it was, maybe it had been Snarl and Hurricane, but then you put in your move, and boom, it was Hyper Beam is what it was. And you just scan him again, boom, there it is. But yeah, you just tap it, and then it tells you their percentage of their IV. And, um, yeah, that's about it. Ooh. Error six has occurred. What is that? All right, let's go at it again. Perfect, small over. And when I see you uh, come through uh, as a friend request, then I'll definitely, definitely be uh, approving you. Me and Destroyer are already friends, so that's cool. Scummery. Scummery. Ah. 
All right. Now he's a flying type and a steel type. Honestly, I don't think Body Slam really does much to him, but if he doesn't know that, then that's good. No, he knows. He knows. He's like, that's not going to do anything to me. It's okay, because I get it off so... I get it off enough times, I can just pound right through this Skarmory. Not even a big deal. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I lost my screen. In the middle of a battle, too. No. All right, I will do my best to narrate it for you guys. He used Brave Bird, Skarmory. As soon as this one is done, yes, I will throw it back up there. Skarmory went down. Figaroth is still in the battle. The enemy has taken out Azumarill. What's next? Figaroth is using a charge-up move. Body Slam. Excellent. He hit the Azumarill. That did regular damage. Oh, what's this? Figaroth has off another Body Slam. And he is charging. And he is going in for the kill. Azumarill used a shield to block the move. And Vigoroth is steadily building up. What's this? Azumarill using a charged move. Vigoroth does not seem to want to use the shield. And the Ice Beam is gone. Oh, Super Spino's using his Azumarill as well. Shiny versus Shiny. Who will win? Who will be victorious? What's this? Super Spino's Azumarill has gotten off the Ice Beam. And it is an excellent attack, but not very effective. Oh no, the opposing Azumarill has gotten off another charge move. Will it be Ice Beam? No, it's Play Rough, which does even more damage than the Ice Beam. What's this? The trainer has withdrawn his Azumarill and is now using a shiny Latios? Latias. Latias. Oh, I apologize for the mistake. Oh, what will shiny Azumarill be able to do? Oh my gosh. He is using a charge move. The Azumarill seems to be blocking it. And Latias uses Outrage, which is blocked by Azumarill. Azumarill is ready, charged up for his Ice Beam, and he is ready. Charging up the move, and it is super effective against the Latias. Latias is still in the fight. What are we going to do, ladies and gentlemen? Is it over for the Super Spino? Or is it over for the opposing trainer? Back out comes the Shiny Azumarill. It is Shiny versus Shiny once again. And Super Spino's Azumarill lets off a play rough and finishes with a bubble beam. Super Spino for the win. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. That was crazy. <laughs> but I'm definitely getting my screen back up. Thank you very much. Mm -mm. Oh, of course. Love this one, guys. This is a great little hit. All right. Let's see. So I'm going to switch back over to something and then switch it back. And then you guys are back. And you can see, for the win, we did it. <laughs> Thanks, Destroyer. I appreciate it. Nice. That, that's a really cool Groudon. That's a super cool Groudon. That's a really nice Groudon, actually. Do you have a shiny Groudon? I have to ask. And then Destroyer. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm all about it. All right. Let me show you. I will show you. Maybe. All right. CP. This is my best bud slash um, most powerful Pokemon. Mewtwo. 4178. Not too bad. But the Veltal guys, he's not bad either. I mean, I'm shy a, li a little bit of candies I'll just show you guys so if I were to power up this Eveltal all the way 4275 which would be just better than my Mewtwo but the thing is Mewtwo could also come in and uh, ooh I need uh, more XL candies and I don't have any oh no but um, yeah so I, I don't know how far up I could get my Mewtwo but I, I would imagine pretty darn far um, but yeah, let me show you guys. So if I push on my shiny, 504, 504 shinies. 
I'll just do a, a brief little overview for you guys so that you can kind of see what I got going on here. My worst Pokemon is a zero star Skarmory. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe a Magikarp. I, I have no idea. But. Sneak peek into the shinies. It's a lot, so I'm going through kind of slow, uh, well, fast-ish. Yeah, this is all the shinies that I got per request, guys. I have tons. And there you go. Heracross is amazing. A 42 CP Heracross, but that's your we weakest one. Yeah, I have, uh, I have a lot of duplicates, and the reason I have so many duplicates is because the majority of these shinies are going to be Pokemon that you found from the community days, like Chimchar, Piplup, Ghastly, Swablu, uh, Snivy, Fletchling... Magikarp, um, Porygon, so that's why, um, <coughs> bless me, sorry guys, aha, that's all of them, but if I were to go um, here and then show you guys my weakest, like, my smallest, no, 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 no. My smallest CP would be this Pidge. This shiny Pidgey. He's not bad. You know, his stats are pretty good. The CP is low. Right? Yeah, my uh, 10, 10 uh, CP Pidgey. But the thing is, that's, the, that's a common misconception because he's not weak. If I were to go in here and say, oh, boom. You know, he's a two-star, which isn't bad. And then I could go through... And if I wanted to, I could power this Pidgey clear the way up to to 719, and then he wouldn't be bad anymore. But it really doesn't depend on the CP, because CP can be changed and increased. It's all about the appraisal and what the appraisal comes back as. Let's see. We're getting tons of these guys just spawning in. I'm going to catch this Carvana, and then we'll go back to battling Back to the battle of the crazies. And then I'm going to switch this one back up. I want to show the Kibble Community Day. Super excited for that one. Alright, guys. Back to the battles. Ooh, shiny check, shiny check. No shiny. Sorry, Bunnel. All right, collecting in on that. We're going with another battle. Politoed, Politoed. All right, what are we going to do here? Politoed. I think we're just going to stick with what we got because the Politoed is a water type. So I'm not too worried about him. Yeah, he's just going to soak up that. Okay. Let's see what he can do. Weather Ball. Nice. Not bad. Didn't kill me, and it didn't uh, glance right off. It that definitely took its toll. I'll use I'll use my he uses shield. I'll use a shield. I'll just put it out there. What's up, Wolfia? I know I don't have a shiny bundle. I know you do, Barton boy. Darn you. Oh, barely. Yeah! I was like, guys, I want to get off my body slam. Can I do it? Yes, I can. Perfect. And I saved that shield. Oof, not very effective. But that's okay. 
Honestly, I'm going to bring out my uh, Azumarill and I'm just going to pelt him with Bubble Beam until he dies. I mean, he'll use Rock Slide. I don't think Rock Slide will be doing much. Wolf, what's up? Welcome to the Spino Nation. And guys, honestly, um, I have a Discord. Uh, and we have a Pokemon channel there where we share our favorite Pokemon. If we catch stuff, we get all hyped up about it. And, uh, you know, we share all that stuff there, guys. It's pretty, pretty fun. Switch over to my Altaria, and honestly, I don't think Altaria is going to take too much from this Weather Ball, unless it's a, an Electric Ball, which I don't... Oh, it's Earthquake. Still not very effective. He just drops. <laughs> okay. Nobody what? Hey, yup. Finally putting out his uh, friend code there for everybody. All right. And we shall continue. Oh, my gosh. Three, two, one. Foul play. All right. I'm going to hit almost all of these feathers. Really? Crap, guys. My Zoomerill is, is in trouble. She's in trouble, guys. But am I going to be able to beat this guy? I hope so. Come on, Zoomerill. You can do it. Ice Beam. Yes! No! 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 Three, two, one. Oh, hit me with the foul play. Oh, it's not very effective! Oh, yeah! What was that? That was a glitch. Did you guys see that? That was crazy. What a glitch. Another win. Axel. I don't know. I don't think I... I might know Axel. I don't... Right at the top of my head doesn't ring a bell. But possibly. 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 Axel 3. Is that you, small lover? Is, are you... Are you... Axel? <laughs> oh, it's a shiny Snivy or Serpy. He's got Frenzy Plant, guaranteed. Which is probably going to do quite a bit of damage to me, and he probably can get it off almost as quick as I can get off these Body Slams. Maybe. Yeah. So far. Alright, I will take it. I will take it. I will definitely take it. Frenzy Plant. Oh! Why am I so dumb? Why did I have to take it? Oh, and he's going with the block. What a jerk. Yeah, I'm blocking this one for sure. I, he used a block. I can use a block too, right? Hopefully. Let's go for it. Aerial Ace. He used Aerial Ace? Why, though? Okay, so he's either going to die with this one, or he's going to use his last shield. Let's hope he uses his last shield. Nope. Oh, well. Talonflame. Need a Zoomerill. He's probably got some uh, Brave Bird or something crazy that's going to kill my Zoomerill. So I am going to use... Flame Charge? Well, it's not as crazy as I was thinking it was going to be. And I wasted my last shield. 
But that's okay. Hopefully he blocks this. Yeah! Woo! Oh, dude. Yes. And, and can I say something? I think that you uh, having that... Oh, I knew he had Brave Bird. I called it. Okay. It's game over for him. Well, for his guy anyway. And then... I got my Altaria, so hopefully my Altaria can take him down. I've barely been able to squeak by. <laughs> barely. Um, but one thing I really like about your goal there... Oh my gosh, it's Altaria versus Altaria. Hopefully he uses a Sky Attack so I can use my Dragon Pulse and kill him. Or Moonblast even. Oh, super effective! Dang it! Oh. Oh. Sad day. Sad, sad day. I barely lost. Barely. With loss is a loss. I got hit some really good Pokemon. Not gonna lie. I guess my downfall was not switching over to my uh, Altaria. I don't know. All right, Granbo, what's up? Killing the game, guys. Killing the game. Ooh, body slam. He didn't even care about that body slam. He's like, yeah, I'm just going to block it. No problem. Wow, that Granbo is hitting me hard, guys. What in the world is happening? And I'm sure... He has at least one charge move. Oh, even playing field now, Gramble. Even playing field now. Sure, hit that Azumarill. He's going to soak up the damage, no problem at all. Oh, small over. I'm so sorry. Yeah, what I love about your goal is how it's broken down. You want to hit level 40 first, and that is your, like, your focus, your target focus. And then once you get there, then you're you're going to jump up and do the other level 50, which is what my goal is. I love how you have it broken down. I think it's fantastic. Because some people are like, oh, I'm hitting 50. And then they get discouraged because it takes really a really long time to get to 50. I'm talking a, a severe long time. Man, I don't ever think I've seen one of these guys in gyms or raids or nothing. I think it's it's over. Not very effective, and he's going to hit me with a very effective move. I got to block this one for sure. For sure. Oh, energy ball? Are you serious? Probably just soak up all the... There we go. I soaked up all the damage in hopes that... In hopes that I'm going to be able to kill this Gallade. <laughs> Fingers crossed, guys. I hope we could do it. Oh, we did it! Yeah! Woo! That was great. That was so amazing. I loved it. All right, we're gonna go. We're gonna go a couple more rounds here, guys. Oh, for sure. Level forty is is a is a thing. Um, but I'll show you. I want to show you really quick. Once you hit level 40, if you don't already know this, this is why I'm sharing it. Um, but if you don't already know this, ooh, and look. Alexel. Alexel. Yeah, Master League. Way to go. But check this out. So once you reach level 40, you have this little binoculars. Whoops. You have these little binoculars, and then you have to do you have to do these tasks. So I have to win 30 trainer battles in the Master League. And I'm going to wait until next season to do that. Because I need 11 million experience. So I'm probably going to have quite a while to do that. Um, but then, you know, winning them in Great League I still need to do. Winning them in Ultra League. So you have to do all of this on top of getting the experience. And then you get a level up. So I'm not sure if you're aware of that yet. 
But uh, yeah, just so it doesn't come as a surprise to you later on. Ooh, four out of five battles. What'd we get? What'd we get? Oh! A white screen? A shield on. Shield on, dude. I love the shield ons. All of the fossil dinosaur types, I, I absolutely love all the fossil dinosaur types, guys. Like, it's my jam. It's my jammy jam, you know? I'm loving it. Alright, so shield on. Now, let's see. And then hold on a second. Let me check this out real quick. So need more ghost and ice types for sure. Anyway. Back to the battle. Okay, yeah, I'm down. I'll uh, I'll open a gift and I'll do you one better. I'll send you a gift too. Level of rank 11, guys. Wow. I can't believe I went from level 10 to 11 that freaking fast. Like, that was insane. That was crazy, guys. Way crazy. Canceling matchmaking? Why? Okay, maybe we need to reboot it. I don't know. Let's, let's do it. Then I'll jump right in there and I'll accept your gift right now. It's still loading. It's thinking about things. Huh. Weird. Well, I'm going to try to reboot this thing again, guys. Let's see. Fingers crossed that it'll load up. I don't know exactly what's taking it so long or why it's being difficult with me, but hey. It's probably overheating from all the amazing battles that we've seen today, guys. That's probably what it is. Close it out again and reopen it. Come on, Pogo. You can do it. Load up for us. Huh. Well. It's weird. Oh, wells. Okay, guys. I appreciate everybody for stopping by. This is going to conclude our sesh for today. Um, yes, I will open gifts and send them to you on the daily. I really try to with as many friends as I have. Sometimes I don't get to all of them, but I, I try. <laughs> but yes, I'll open your gift as soon as I can. Yeah, kick me out too, and then won't let me join back in, which is whatevs. Um... But alright guys, I appreciate you. Thank you so much for all the follows, guys. We, we do this every Sunday, so we will catch you next Sunday on another episode of the Super Spino Streams, guys. We'll see you.